Alrighty, here we've got Summer Island Battle Tactics. Uh, this is the demo of a current game in progress on the NES, courtesy of Ninja, uh, Ninja Dynamics. Um, I would thank them for the opportunity of this ROM. Uh, this releases tomorrow um, as of the recording of this video. Uh, should we, receive it? we should be seeing it today. Um, and this is actually pretty awesome. So this is a work in progress. I'm going to go ahead and hit start here. So you have the option of playing stage one or stage two. I'm going to do stage one. You have daytime and sunset and nighttime, which is pretty awesome. Oh, you also have sunrise. Okay, I didn't notice that before. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I got a couple of options here. So I'm going to go ahead and sh actually go ahead and show sun. Actually, I'll do daytime. So player one, player two is this going to be the CPU. And here we go. So this is a, you know, this is a work in progress. The, the ROM that comes out tomorrow of the demo is going to be a little more polished than this. But essentially this is going to be what this is. So this is showing the battle mechanics. So it is a, uh, a turn-based strategy game. I've got uh, Sir Cedric here. Over the uh, I assume is the blue team and red team, but this looks like purple and orange to me. Uh, maybe maybe I'm color, but I don't I don't know. <laughs> but that's just the way it looks like it looks to me. Uh, so pretty impressive. I like the scrolling effect. Uh, it's really awesome, really neat. Um, uh, the the text is really really uh, easy to read, so I do like that as well. Um, the one thing I the one criticism I have really with this um, is the fact that. The text at the bottom kind of gets obscured a little bit. I feel like it's kind of hard to read. Um, I'm, I'm hoping that gets addressed in the demo tomorrow. If not, maybe it could be uh, cleaned up um, uh, at some point during development, or maybe well, yeah, some point during during development. Um, maybe having like a like like a box around it, like kind of like you'd have like with a with a sort of the JRPG like Final Fantasy where it has the the box at the bottom, maybe have something like that show up, just so that it's more, um, it stands out more, because it, it just, it looks very busy down there, what I'm referring to is the the stats there, so you got the health and the and the attack uh, at the bottom there, it looks just too obscure, too, there's too much going on there, it's not, it's not prominent enough, I feel like, um, but other than that, I mean, combat's fluid, um, so if I were to go ahead and just move my, actually I'm just, I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna just do, let's see my turn. Say team red or team orange. They take his turn. Oh, cool, they got bombs. And stones, I'm assuming that's to throw at me. That's great, that's awesome. Team blue, yeah, like I said, it looks looks, looks purple and orange to me. But that's okay. All right, we're gonna go ahead and try to attack. This squid can't can't attack anymore. Okay. Uh, the chests on the battlefield don't do anything, as far as I can tell, just yet. Something that hasn't been implemented. But like I said, the combat's fluid enough. Uh, it shows promise. Uh, I love the animations of, of the characters. Uh, again, the presentation, the scrolling the animation, everything looks really, really good. Um, the only criticism I have thus far, besides the fact there's not more to it, but hey, it's a demo, it's a work in progress, I understand that. Um, all jokes aside, the, the presentation at the bottom there with the stats is really my only complaint so far. Um, at least at this stage. But, I mean, the music's great. I like the music. I mean, I know it's a placeholder. I feel like it's a placeholder. Um, and that's okay. And I'm not sure if there's a reason to attack those rocks. But, uh... Oh. Okay, so that, 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 there we go. So I'm going to out of it. Awesome. So no special. Oh, I can't do anything right now. 
But yeah, it's an awesome game, guys. You got you got four different times of day to play in, which is really cool. It's really rather impressive, like I said, for an NES game. Um, in fact, uh, let's go ahead and I'm going to reset the game. I'm going to reset it. And we're going to play stage one again. Okay, and we're going to do Sunrise. So see how the, the color palette changes in the back. It looks, really, it looks really good. I can't get over how good this overall presentation is. It really is awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and just reset again. And we'll check out the other times of day here. So we did daytime. We did Sunrise. Let's do Sunset. So color palette's pretty much the same, but the sun's now gone uh, down uh, below the horizon. And we'll reset one more time, and we'll do night. Do night time. I really like the way this looks. Oh, yeah, this game is great. I understand, like I said, it's a work in progress. It's a, it's a, it is a demo of a demo. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, it looks really good. Now, see, the, the text the text here looks better. It looks more, a little more prominent. But I think it has to do with the fact that everything else is dark around it. And this is white on, on a darker green uh, foliage. But I do, like I said, I do think that uh, there needs to be some kind of, of means to have that text stand out a bit more than it does. <laughs> So you can attack the chest to open it up, but you can't actually get anything out of it yet. Now, if I were to go ahead and let's do scenario two. Reset yet again. So stage two. We'll do daytime. And here's stage two. Again, this game shows a lot of promise. actually use a potion and see what it looks like. That's cool. Alright. That's neat. But yeah, guys, this is um, Summer Island Battle Tactics on NES. The demo officially this is tomorrow, Christmas Eve. Um, I'm, I'm hoping to see uh, some some presentation improvements. Not sure what that means entirely, but that's the last thing we heard from the dev over on X. Um, just happy to happy to check this out. I want to thank them for their opportunity. Um, I want to thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, and as always, until next time, take care and happy gaming.